For the Invisible You exhibit, I've been working with a scientist, Dr Linda Long, who is a research fellow at the Exeter Medical School, and a composer, Jack Hurst, who's based at the Royal College of Music. And together we've been creating a kind of soundscape that maps the microbial habitats of the body. And Jack and I converted the RNA sequencing, which is the unique branch of coding, like DNA coding for microbes. And then we worked with Linda to create music from the molecules that are produced by the microbes that are vital for the body. So that, was, that entailed mapping the 3D structure of um, molecules and proteins and translating this into music through a computer generated program. I wanted to make this invisible world kind of a palpable and a visual experience. So I've taken 3D scans of my body and got these computer milled out of acrylic block. So you have a life size scale replica of the body. And then I've projected moving image into this so that you can get an impression of the invisible worlds that are kind of in flux within you. One of the most interesting aspects of this project was how three people can get together from three completely distinct um, fields like science and art and music and how you find a common ground through your language and actually by looking at your specialism in a different context you kind of it reveals how everything's so interrelated. <laughs>